don't feel out of place. In any event, I will talk about it. Just um, have fun, enjoy, and when you see someone comes through the door a little bit late, please welcome them next to you, feel them, uh, um, make them feel welcome and warm, and have a seat and help them, you know, uh, join us as quickly as possible. So this is a new device here, and I think with all the Wi-Fi noises, it makes a little bit of a noise uh, here and, uh, every once in a while. I can, can you, how oh, can you hear me okay? And all the way to that? Okay. Um, so this is our third meeting. This group is called Valley Peninsula Real Estate Buying and Investing Group. Uh, this group is also on Mita. Uh, this group is also, uh, you know, subgroups of it are the Melpitas Real Estate Investing Group and the San Jose Area Opportunity Group. There are three groups on meetups that are actually the same one uh, as it comes to meeting together. Uh, like I said, this is our uh, third meeting. So just quickly about the group, we're here to learn about real estate investing, to network, to interact, possibly uh, get to know other like-minded people that we can potentially work with, brainstorm with, pollinate each other, etc. cetera, um, so we can um, do more on our journey of real estate, you know, real estate investing. It doesn't really matter if you're starting, you're continuing, you're waking up again to the world of real estate investing because of what was going on. It doesn't really matter. In this group, as I know, some of the people in the group, they are experienced real estate investors, they are beginners, they are professionals such as realtors, mortgage brokers, or other service provider of the real estate industry. So the point is to get us all together, you know, you know to not just network, but possibly make the most out of this uh, uh, meeting. Uh, like, it, like it says on the, on the screen, the meetings are free. My, I, my plan is to keep those meetings free so it will be no hassle and no excuse, uh, you know, as little excuses as possible for you guys to show up. The way we get uh, supported is the, the main speaker, I ask every main speaker to come and pay something, you know, n you know some fee, uh, very, you know, a very modest fee just to help cover all the costs. This is not a money making uh, venue by any... Uh, sort of way, and your support is also something that we, that we uh, base on. By the way, did I say that someone is buying us drink tonight? <laughs> did I say that? Do you know who this person is? You wouldn't recognize by the, you know, by the phone, so thank you, <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> okay, you choose the place though. All right. So basically I just want to, uh, want to have fun, let's enjoy, uh, network, and find out um, uh, more about real estate investing. Um, the, re the ways we can be successful is be active part of the group. Being active means show up, RSVP to the meetings, change your, update your RSVP. If you cannot show up, that's fine. Um, bring your friends, uh, suggest speakers, suggest topics, put some notes and reviews on the meetup wall. Uh, maybe put something on Twitter, if you tweet every once in a while, saying you're here at the meeting, and so on and so forth. Just be active about the meeting, active about the meetup, and most importantly, come and show up. Coming meetings are, um, since this is a new group, I'm trying to stabilize the venues that we are using. Last, last month we were in, uh, in Cupertino, then the month before that we were in Mountain View in a different venue. We're gonna be here for the next four meetings, this one and three more. Hopefully we can make it our home, home base. Um, you know, it's not that easy when you're trying to minimize the cost for a venue. So next meeting, the coming meetings are April 13th over here. We have an attorney who's gonna come and talk about entities, partnership, groups, etc. cetera. Uh, I'm actually very much looking forward for that meetup. Uh, this is a friend of mine, I asked him to come over. And he really wants to make it on the, as an open uh, discussion. The meeting after that, we have uh, Thomas, who's our, all the way in the back. Maybe you can stand up and say, so everybody will know you. Um, he's, he has his own meetup group. Uh, talks about you know, a lot of experience from the private lending in, you know, uh, industry. So he's going to come here. Uh, I've seen Tom speak and actually organizing in his, his own group. He's like standing and saying, few words and then let's make it a discussion. So it's really, you know, someone who wants to share his knowledge and expertise and he's gonna be here 
presenting on May 11. You can know very well this is a real estate investment group when you have a disclaimer on the wall. I'm just asking it's in plain simple, don't sue me. Don't come back to bite me. I'm here to network. I'm here to have fun. I'm here to meet other people. I'm here to learn myself. All the speakers that I bring is actually topics that are interesting to me to learn. So please take those, you know, take the general understanding of education and, you know, act safely accordingly. Use the professional, you know, use the advice from professional. But please don't come to bite me. This is me. I'm Dan Made Orr. Uh, this is my contact information. Um, on the web, under the, my, uh, I guess my webby name is Simply Do It. You can find me simplydoit.net, on Twitter, Simply Do It, on Facebook, LinkedIn, everywhere you will go, probably on the net. If you write Simply Do It, that's me. You can easily uh, get in touch with me if you want to.